Hey Shell Point, John High, your Academy Manager, back with you again to talk about another uh, exciting session we have coming up here in the Academy. This session is going to be on Thursday, February 20th, uh, 10 o'clock in the Grand Cypress Room. I am here with Associate Pastor from the Village Church, Don Pullen, and the title is Relationship Foundation, Authority and Submission. Huh? All right, what do we need to know? Oh, John, I'm willing to go there. You are, huh? Willing to go into the discussion that a lot of us have are challenged to have. Yeah, for sure. Talking about how to work on relationships together. Mm. And, and I think as we look at Scripture, the Bible is very clear in giving us the wisdom that we need. And it's all about authority and submission. Mm. You know, who are the leaders that we have in our lives? Who are the people that are speaking truth in? into our lives so that mm -hmm. we submit to them and then how as how can we um, as we submit to them support their leadership yeah. and then how can we be the best leaders uh, that we can be so that interaction between authority and submission is really a, a um, wonderful foundation to build relationships on yeah it's okay let's talk a little about these different authorities that I have in my oh, life yeah. maybe give me some examples now are, are you married I am married yes well there's right. an authority at home right now <laughs> there is, right there is yeah. the husband okay. and wife and the Bible talks about that and okay. children yeah. grandchildren and mm. so there's there's a specific uh, hierarchy that yeah. God has given and it really is good it's not a bad it, thing right no. hierarchy is not a bad thing. no 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 yeah, because whenever you have more than one there better be a way for this group to move forward, yes. to make decisions, like joint it. decisions. Yeah. And so uh, recognizing the Bible says the husband has the primary responsibility and the, wife's, and the wife's job is to support her husband and the children are to listen to their parents, all yeah. those things. And when we do that, not in an authoritarian way, not yeah. in a yeah. domineering yeah. way, not in a hurtful way, we can actually build a relationship that mm, grows. And harmony. so there's one right there. How about uh, government? Mm. Uh, no, well, am I willing to go to, there? Yeah, wow, yeah okay. you know, do, are, are we the best kind of citizens? Because isn't a, the role of the citizen to submit to their government, to, to, to submit to their authorities? I think there's a verse which, or two about that. Yeah, yeah. which yeah. scripture talks about that as yeah, well. And, how to do and it. yeah, we can do the best job as citizens mm. by, by submitting. Does that mean that we uh, agree with everything that a given president or a given governor or a given even community leader. Yeah. Do we have to agree 100%? No, we don't, but we uh, work on our disagreements in the right way. Yeah. We, we can be supportive without necessarily being uniform, uh, to, to have that unity that groups need to have. Yeah. And then there's, you know, both you and I still work for a living, so there's that work dynamic. All of us uh, have had bosses, and so, you know, how, how, do we, how do we provide uh, leadership in those settings, and how do we work under in those settings? Yeah. Scripture talks about that, and then it also talks about larger organizations. For example, the church. The church has leadership. You know, mm. Pastor Andy and myself are on the the staff leadership team, and then we have elders, and then we mm -hmm. have the the congregation of the church, and and we all should be under, as well as uh, giving good authority in mm. order for relationships to work. Very good. Wow. Shell Point, this is going to be a very good session. You're going to want to be at it. And once again, it is Thursday, February 20th, 10 a.m. in the Grand Cypress. Be sure to sign up through our concierge desks, and we're looking forward to seeing you there.